Hi there, Ken from Wally World here with another helpful tip. Today we're showing you how to clean museum glass. It may be called masterpiece glass, it may be called all kinds of different things in your neck of the woods, but here we call it museum glass. It has a coating on it made of small prisms and makes it almost invisible to see. However, and uh, I'm gonna take my little hand sanitizer here. Clean up my hands real good. Uh, the problem with the museum glass, <laughs> if you do anything as far as touch it or even clean it wrong, you end up with quite an obvious flaw in your glass. You can clearly see my hand there. The uh, alcohol is cleaned off and that's what's left. So if you use a glass cleaner like Windex that has ammonia in it, that ammonia is going to streak the finish on this glass very easily. It's going to cause you more trouble than good. So there's a the real trick to cleaning museum glass is using the right product. We use this ultralight. It's ammonia free and alcohol free. I buy it in a concentrated bottle and dilute it with uh, distilled water. Uh, it's something that if you're having trouble finding it, go to your local frame shop, ask your local framer. They probably buy it in bulk like I do and bring in a spray bottle and say, hey, can I have some glass cleaner? Uh, if you buy enough of this glass from them, I'm sure they'd be happy to send you home with a little bottle of glass cleaner for it. But uh, here's going to be the technique. The, the main secret to cleaning museum glass is you don't want to overdo it with glass cleaner. Just want to do enough to clean the glass. You want to actively dry the glass with your rag. You don't want the air to dry the glass. You want to be the one drying it. So if you put on way too much glass cleaner, you're going to be there forever, wiping and wiping and wiping. It's going to cause you some troubles. So, I use a microfiber towel. Uh, if you do this regularly enough, if you're gonna go through your house and do all your pictures with museum glass, get a brand new fresh microfiber and dedicate it to just cleaning museum glass. You don't want anything else on this, furniture polish, anything. That's gonna cause you trouble. Now, so a nice, clean, fresh microfiber towel, I guarantee you it'll be worth your trouble if you have to go out and buy a package of them just for this one job. It'll be fine. Uh, but okay, we'll, we'll go to cleaning. You can see my handprint here if you take a look at that. It's, uh, it's good and on there. Yep, doesn't come off too easily. Uh, I'm going to give it a light coating of glass cleaner, just a, a light spritz of it, and then I'm going to be actively cleaning it. So, as you can see, I'm the one that dried that glass. The, it didn't do that on its own. I didn't let it sit. My hand's gone. It's streak free, it looks just right. Piece of cake, right? With the right tools, the right knowledge, and the right supplies, you're in good shape. This won't be any trouble at all. I'm Ken from Wally World Gallery in Orm Beach. Thanks for joining me with this uh, helpful tip of the day. We'll see you again.